For the latest top tips, reviews and advice, please subscribe below. Hello and welcome to Atwell's Camping Leisure. Today I've got the Camper Inflatable Party Tent here with me. Uh, it's a groundbreaking uh, new concept uh, for the 2016 season. So it's the first inflatable party tent on the market uh, and certainly plenty to be talking about with this thing. So Camper, which are very well known for their awnings and also their tents and certainly their inflatable awnings and tents, um, also previously done party tents. So what they've done is sort of bring the two concepts together and now you've got the first ever inflatable party tent. So the joys of this actually is one person could actually pitch it on their own. Uh, admittedly, if you're using a hand pump, which I've done myself, uh, it does take quite a lot of work. Personally, I think you'd best off really buying the inflatable pump uh, that you can get from Camper. It's a sort of a specialized pump which you physically set the PSI to what pressure you want it to be in and you press it go and you can sit back and relax. Um, so we've got a few pitching videos on our uh, at all's uh, channel on YouTube so check that out if you're interested in this particular model. The model behind me which I've got here is the 4x8. They do two other sizes as well so you've got a 4x6 and a 4x4. So prices for the 2016 season the 4x8 is going to be about £1,100, the 4x6 is going to be £900 and then the 4x4 is about £750. So that's approximately the prices for the 2016 season. Really nice model. Um, the choice of it goes up in once, so you goes up in one whole pitching, so there's only a couple of extra brace of beams you have to put in, which are nice and simple anyway, so you don't have to worry about that in terms of the hassle. Uh, but the joys of the party tents, obviously, is you can use them for multiple different purposes. So you can use it as a garage, as um, for weddings or feet, you know events, functions, anything like that, really. A lot of people will take these to shows and use them for selling bits and bobs as well in, so it's a... Uh, a really good concept I think that certainly changes the way we look at sort of structures and that sort of thing as well. Uh, truth be told there are other inflatable um, sort of party tent or marquee styles on the market. The difference between this one and that is the fact that this actually is um, self-contained so once you pumped it up it's all good to go. With other competitors on the market which are a lot more expensive this particular they have to have a, a composite compressor Kind of like a um, bouncy castle in many ways, keeping the airflow in them. So yet again, you can't take them into the middle of nowhere because you need the power. With this, once it's pumped up, it's all set to go. So it's a really nice concept. Now, it comes with, as you see, the storm straps, which go all the way around. You do get additional storm straps if you want for the next point down to give it additional strength. But personally, I think that's sort of decent enough. I mean, we've had this pitched up here for a couple of days now, uh, and it's weathered everything that's come at it. So it's a really impressive model. You've got, like a normal party tent, loads of clear doors and end doors. So if you want to, you can have them completely up so you can have a good circulation of air or if you want to, you can have people walking in and out. So it's a really nice sort of thing, that. Yeah, again, like I said, you've got two open, main open doors in the end. So if you wanted to, you can use it as like a garage and get sort of a car through there and there's plenty of height throughout. Uh, but from the outside of things, that's what a party tent looks like. But we'll have a little look inside and see what else we can find. So now we're inside the pipe tent, you can certainly see how much room you've got in it. It's tons of space and plenty of width throughout. So like I said, this particular model here is 4 by 8 meters. So you do, like I said, a 4 by 6 and also a 4 by 4. So there's plenty of variation depending on how big you want it to be. Uh, you've got lovely big open PVC windows so you can get plenty of light in and use it sort of as a backdrop. Alternatively, if you wanted to have it open, the windows just literally zip up. So One zip either side. And then what you can happily do is roll that up and then use it as a nice doorway. So yeah, like so. So the joy of this is tons of height along the top uh, and plenty of room for putting stands or whatever you want in it. Or like I said, on the outside, you can quite happily put a car inside of it. Now, um, in terms of the way it inflates up, it inflates up as one, but you've got additional um, beams to give yourself a bit more support. So positioned sort of here. 
got the beams. So they're just brace the beams just to go along the side to give a bit more support. But the main ones along the roof um, are actually fixed in and they're in connected. So the choice is when it's actually up in this position, you don't have to pump up those up there because they're already inflated. And that's what actually allows it to sort of pitch itself and it comes up as one whole unit. But these you push pump up separately. So you've got a normal sort of buxton valve on there. No different to what you find on any awnings or the tents. And they just pop in like so. And yet you've got almost like a Velcro little capsule just to keep them in. So I'll pop that back in there. And then the Velcro capsule just goes round like so. Uh, on the end here, you've got a lovely big sort of door. So out from the outside, you can see the door on the front. But it's the same sort of principle on the side where you can just literally zip it up and use it as a door. See again, nice and open, open up the other side and you're good to go. One thing you may notice is the fact that on the base of here you've got sort of straps. Now it's not necessarily, it doesn't put anyone off, it's just to make sure the beams are the correct distances away from each other. But you've actually on the main ones across the middle here, you've got the ability to unclip those. So if you want to use it as a walkway, you don't have to worry about people sort of tripping up on them. Um, but it's very similar in terms of the beams that you find in the inflatable awnings. So each beam has got uh, sort of three layers, like an outer sleeve, it sits in the main party tent then sort of the uh, external sort of bladder and then the internal bladder. So the internal bladder is obviously what you inflate, but then you've got two layers of protection around it. So um, God forbid if you did have anything go wrong, you can quite happily like with the tents, unzip it, unzip it down to the bladder, repair it, zip back it in or replace it completely. So uh, it's a really good concept and something that's made to last. So even sort of two or three years down the line or even longer, uh, you can, should be able to get spares no problem at all. So in essence, Really good concept, and in terms of the prices, obviously 750, 900, and 1100 for the ability to have something that's a lot more um, removable so you can take it from A to B. Because, it, like I said, you haven't got the burden of poles or anything like that, so it means in terms of the pack down size, it is a decent size. So, what you find is you're not necessarily um, taking a large vehicle or a van to get to your location, you can quietly put it in the boot of your car and take it no problem at all. Admittedly, when you get there, um, one person probably couldn't lift it up. I mean, I, I've done that. I'm, I would say I'm a fairly strong chap, uh, and I can move from A to B, but it was a bit of a struggle. So, ideally, two people to um, move from A to B, but once you get there, you can put it on, up on your own. Like I said on the outside, I would strongly recommend that inflatable pump, just for the point is that it does make your life a lot easier and a lot less hassle. And while it's sort of inflating up, you can sort of get on with other jobs as well. So. It's a really good concept, certainly here at Outwards we do love it and some we are stocking for the 2016 range. Uh, if you are interested, by all means uh, contact us at uh, www.atwalls.co.uk, alternatively give us a call on 01452 742 233 and we will actually have uh, one of these inflatable party tents up in our shop in Whitminster. So you can by all means come in and have a look at it and sort of get a grasp of what the quality is like uh, and obviously the concept as well. So. Uh, that's all me for me from Matt Walls here. Um, but like I was saying, double check on our YouTube videos for uh, the pitching video of this particular model.